Hey y'all, it's your girl Simona. Welcome back to my channel. So y'all, look how cute this V part wig is. Let's go ahead and get straight into this video. Today we'll be working with Harella Hair again, y'all. I am so in love with this company. So they did send over this wig, but let's get into the goodie box. As y'all can see, they did send over a wig cap, some cute purple clips, this orange scarf, which I'm in love with because y'all, I haven't had orange in so long. And um, those lashes, y'all, those are the best. The scarf is just super cute. It's giving me like beach vibes. And another wig cap, of course. They also sent over this cute little hair clip. I probably not put that in, but yeah, it's still cute. And they also sent over, you know, the headband. So this is the V-part wig. It is 24 inches. And look how easy. I'm going to show you guys how easy it is to put on just to snap it right in your head and make it look so natural. Just get up and go. You don't have to worry about sewing it in. Nothing. Just, I'm about to show y'all. So I already have my leave out out and y'all look my edges look crazy my hair is already braided down so right now I'm just about to go in and flick my edges so I do like to use my gel I used to like I use my eco styler and my edge control to just go in and slick my hair I need to find something better to slick it with but for now this will work. So now it's time to go ahead and put the wig on. I like to go ahead and just secure the back comb first and then I just snap in the ones at the top just because it makes it easier and it holds it better when I'm trying to snap it in. But it's just so easy. Like it's really a get up and go situation. I would like to advise I did go ahead and put some black cellophane on the hair so that it could blend with my hair because it does come in like a natural brown and my hair is like really really dark so right now I'm just parting out my hair and I'm about to go ahead and just straighten it all together so we could get it just super cute blended and make it look like a natural sewing A tip for using oils on your hair, make sure you're using like a lightweight oil because you don't want to use something too heavy and then it just weighs your hair down and then it has it looking all greasy and oily. So lightweight oils is the best way to go. Um, so right now I'm just doing it in sections and y'all, I know y'all probably like your hair look a little greasy, but like watch when I blend it all together, it's going to look super cute.
Yo, hear me now. Everybody do that dance, you're nasty up, and them nasty up. Fix things, fix things, loop it. Well, all right then. Can you see me a cleanest? You was on me rocking at the fucking realest. Chi ching ching. In a the low with the best. Girl, one with his squeeze, he can I'm real blessed. Can I be a breeze for the head of the penis? Coolest breeze that me rocking a sleeveless. Hey! 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 So there you guys have it, you guys. This is the final look. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to check the description box below because it will have the links to this exact hair as well as other hairs. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it.